Hello everyone, this is Mayank Sangvi from vlemon.com and I'm back with another Google Cloud Compute Engine tutorial video and in this video we will learn how to install SSL certificate on our Nginx web server. For this video we are going to refer this blog post. The blog post URL is available in the description of this video or you can click on this notification icon. In our previous video we learned how to map our domain with Google Cloud Compute Engine VM instance. We learned how to create a server block or virtual host for our domain myangsangvi.triple okay in this video we are going to create a ssl certificate for this myangsangvi.triple domain to install ssl certificate we will use let's encrypt certificate boot for issuing the ssl certificate and to install the ssl certificate on our domain to use let's encrypt certificate boot we need to first install it on our ubuntu 18.04 machine to install Let's encrypt certificate boot. We need to first open the SSH panel. So I already opened the SSH panel for this video. So let me quickly arrange my browser windows. Okay. The next thing we need to copy this command one line at a time and then we, are, we need to paste this command inside the terminal. The first command is used to update the Ubuntu software repository okay so it is done the next command i'm going to copy this and then i'm going to paste it inside terminal hit enter yes definitely i want to apply all these changes so i'm going to click on yes okay the next command is for our certificate boot repository we need to add this so i'm going to execute this command uh yes confirm this is also done let me quickly Next, again, we need to update the repository for Ubuntu. Now, what is the difference between this update and this update? Previously, we executed this update without the certificate boot repository. And this update, we executed this update with this uh, launchpad.net cert boot repository. Okay, so this is the difference between previous update and this update. Okay, so in previous update, we don't have the record or entry for our launchpad.net repository for certificate boot. Okay, so we are almost done. The next command we need to use to install install the certificate boot on our on our Ubuntu server. Okay, so this command is for Nginx. If you are using Apache, then you need to use the Apache specific commands. Okay. If you are looking the same step for Apache, so let me quickly check the blog post for Apache and I'm going to share the URL for Apache in the description of this video or you can click on this notification icon. So how to install SSL certificate for your domain in Google Cloud, uh, Google Cloud Platform VM instance. This blog post is for Apache. Okay, so this is for Apache. Okay, so our uh, certificate boot installation is completed successfully. Now, next thing to install SSL certificate, we need to use this command. So I'm going to copy this command and I'm going to paste it. Now, before executing this command, I'm assuming you are done with all this server block or virtual host related configuration. Okay. If you are not done with this, then you are not able to execute this command. If you are going to execute this command, you are not able to see the domains. Okay, so we need to perform this step first. So I'm going to hit enter. The first thing you need to provide your email address on which you the first thing in this we need to provide our email address on which we want an alert. So I'm going to use info at the rate Mayank Sangvi dot com hit enter now the next thing you need to agree with the terms and condition i'm fine with this terms and condition i'm going to type a and hit enter okay if you want to share your email address with other providers click on yes if you don't want to share your email address with any other provider please type n and then hit enter okay so I created the server block for myangsangvi.triple o so that's why we are able to see myangsangvi.triple o and www.myangsangvi.triple o okay if you did not create any server block then you are not able to see anything here 
Now here we need to provide the domains on which we need to install the certificate. I want to install certificate on myingsangvi.triplo and www.myingsangvi.triplo. So that's why I'm going to provide one comma two. If you need to provide, if you are not going to provide anything by default, blank. It means select all option shown. Okay. So let's try with blank. Hit enter. Okay, so it is going to create the challenge for myingsangvi.triplo and www.myingsangvi.triplo. If you have more than two option, you can use blank. If you have only two option, then you can also enter one comma two. Okay, so installation for certificate is done. The next thing is whether you want to redirect your HTTP traffic on HTTPS. Yes, definitely. That's why we install SSL. Yes, I want to redirect my HTTP traffic on HTTPS. Okay, so I'm going to select the second option, redirect. Make all the requests redirect to secure HTTPS access. So I'm going to provide two and hit enter. So our our certificate for domain myingsangvi.triplo is installed successfully. To check this, I'm going to open my browser window and I'm going to change the protocol from HTTPS to I'm going to change the protocol from HTTP to HTTPS. Okay, so it's now secure with green bar. So these are the steps to install SSL on Ubuntu 18.04 for Nginx web server. If you want to know how to renew your let's encrypt SSL certificate, then by default let's let's encrypt certificate certificate boot package comes with a cron job which automatically re renew your uh, renew your ssl certificate okay if you want to check you can test the automatically renewal for your certification by running this command so let me quickly copy this command and i'm going to paste it just here hit enter okay so this is a dry run if you don't want to perform a dry run you need to remove all this all this step is same okay so in this it is checking whether the certificate is need to renew or not based on this it is going to perform the next step so i hope now you are able to install ssl certificate for on your ubuntu 18.04 with nginx web server again for apache you need to refer this blog post the blog post url is available in the description of this video or you can click on this notification icon so that's it for this video if you like this video don't forget to click on like subscribe share it with everyone provide your feedback and see you all in the next google cloud computer engine tutorial video some important URLs.